Hello, welcome back to Oxygen Not Included Spaced Out Edition here on our DC Colony, where in the last episode, we were uh, trying to figure out how to melt ice. Alright, so, we are actively building some of this stuff. We've already melted some, so, hey, positive. Uh, we are going to cancel these, because, you know, we were kind of, um, stupid to build those. Uh, background buildings. Okay, we're gonna deconstruct these. <clears throat> and instead, we're gonna melt this ice! Now, this is probably a slow way of doing this. You know? But for right now, I'm okay with it. It's not like our dupes have tons of work to do. So we're just gonna throw in a bunch of temp shift plates to melt ice. <laughs> for now, to get it started, right? Uh, and then of course we're building the pipe and everything. So this is good. Now the other thing we can do, so we can get oxygen and stuff flowing into everything, is we can hook this up. <coughs> I didn't realize that it wasn't hooked up. And so as a result, it wasn't sending water over to our system. Um, you know, because we have a little bit here. We, we can... <coughs> Thank goodness. We can do that. Alright, anyways. That is taken care of. Um, Kitty, can I move you? Just, yeah, right there. Thank you. That's much easier on my arm. <laughs> Alrighty. Next. Uh, and yeah, we still got it on slow because we've got so many things to do. Um, the first thing that we want to do is get our Sweetles. Okay. So let's take the Sweetles off of these. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then let's let's grab our sweetles. Let's, let's wrangle. We're gonna wrangle you, you, and you guys. And we're gonna get you into our farm down here. Alright, excellent. And then we're gonna feed our sweetles sulfur. Okay, so We'll get this going. Uh, we'll set up some automation to drop it. This is a closed room. Um, let me see. We want deconstruct buildings. Let's, we can deconstruct these and replace the floor. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. We can get this going and put these in place. So many little things to do here. Did we make this room the right size? It's a hundred tiles. How dare us? <laughs> we didn't make it the right size. <laughs> no problem. We can, we can move things over. got so much work to do here, but it's okay. We're doing fine. Okay, so now let's let's get this move to there, this move to here. Cool. So this will get the Sweetles going. We got sulfur in this already so that they can start doing that and then let's start grooming them. 
so that we can get um, happy little Sweetles. Alright, so we got a grub egg here, a grub... Okay, so let's move you here. So we have a grub egg in each of these. And then they'll be natural. <clears throat> because we're not going to groom them. And we'll just go from there. So, perfect. Alright, excellent, excellent, excellent. Let's check this out. I'm not going to bring anybody in because of food issues. But we'll go ahead and take the copper. Alright, and then this... We were going to put the pip up here. Or pips... In case, in case we, we need to, right? Is that Pip still in here? No, he's not. Okay, well, he escaped. We will wrangle you anyways. So you don't empty out chests where we don't want you to empty out chests. <laughs> All right, and then we can, we can remove these. Perfect. Okay, so that gets this going. Their mood is glum, which is no fun. Um, let me see. We are good to start up our oxygen production. Let's get our pipes back in back in place. All right, excellent. That gets the oxygen coming back in and all of that good stuff. All right, cool. <clears throat> um. Oh, they are running. Okay, good. <laughs> I was going to say, are these things even running? And yes, the answer is yes, they are. All right, good. And then we're getting um, all of this. Uh, we're still keeping this here. Um, let's just go ahead and put this like this. Since we're building these, we'll move all that down. Um, it's, it's fairly cool, but temperature-wise, this should help help push temperature up more. Um, we can probably make it a little bit better to get the temperature going. <laughs> By doing that. Um, I don't want to build too much of this because we could end up freezing the whole thing. Um, because, you know, right now... <laughs> but all the ambient temperature around it is going to heat up. I probably should have made some of these lead. <coughs> but that's okay. Um, you know, so that they could... Not lead, but, you know, metal tiles. A floor of metal so it conducts the heat. But, you know, I'm not intelligent enough to think of these things. And now, of course, I have water here, so it's like, oh, well... <laughs> Anyways, we're going to do that. Um, and then we got this going. So, I mean, we're going to get to where we need to. All right. Now, one thing that we need to do is this is going to start picking up sucrose. See? Hey, we've already pooped some out. Um, so, I need to figure out where it's going to send that sucrose. So right now, it's going to collect here. It's going to collect here. Um, we can deconstruct those. It's coming here. It's going to go here. This is filtering out what? Fungal spores. Well, we don't have fungal spores anymore. Um, so we can, we can change. We could probably take this out although eventually it might be grabbing the eggs out of here that might be good so that we don't overpopulate so let's let's come to eggs critter eggs and let's do sweetle eggs there we go all right now it'll just throw the sweetle eggs this way It's going to just throw the eggs 
we don't want the eggs down here. Um, what we can do, let me see, is there's nothing else on this, right? Oh no, there's something else coming from down here. It's picking up the meat and the food. But this is just the sweet eggs. Okay, so we could do this. We can cut that. Deconstruct this one. And for now, because it won't hurt anything, we can just throw the Sweetle eggs in here. They, they won't be picked up or anything. All right, cool. And then this is going to come up and it's going to dump the sucrose into here. Um, so it'll sit on the floor. That's fine. We'll, we'll change some things. Maybe we'll move this out here. Um, we could move... No, it's not in range. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll think about what change we want to make there. But right now, that's that's what we're going to do. Let's make sure... want to make sure we're okay over here. Yeah, we need to sweep these up. Do we have re replacements? We don't. So let's get this one swept up. Um, I think this is still on sweep only, right? Yeah, atmosphere sweep. Okay, good. We'll send another another one over there. I only have one here. Um, kind of amazing. I only have one. <clears throat> We're going to make a few more. <clears throat> Alright, cool. All right, we got oxygen coming back in, um, so we're good. We're not wasting any oxygen anywhere. That is good. We're fine. I'm not worried about any of that. This is just going out into that. Um, I don't need this active. I'm just going to turn that off for now. Okay. Cool. And we got our Sweetles here, and they are mood and happy now. Sweetle happiness. I'm going to assume that they can have one of these. So we're just going to stick it right here in the middle. Uh, we can come in here and for now we won't put the Sweetle eggs on. We want the population to go higher, but we want... Is it a cooking ingredient? No. So consumable or sucrose. There we go. So we've got our sucrose. Copy settings. There we go. We are already picking up the sucrose to the kitchen. So so that problem is solved. Uh, these guys will hatch eventually. 68%. Um, we've already moved one down here. 69%. So perfect. All right. That is all working good. And then down here... <coughs> Let's get that mopped up and this mopped up. We can do that. We've already melted a lot of this, so I'm not going to put more ice in yet. <coughs> Excuse me. Because I want... Um... Oh, good. The temperature... The, these helped. Awesome. That has helped a lot by moving this in. Cool. So our water is a little bit chilly, but it'll warm up. We're going to, before we pump it out and stuff, we're still building the pipe, but um, it'll start collecting and, and all that good stuff. But I will go ahead and put in um, another one here on top. All right, cool. So that'll help us because that's going to get water over here. And then we can build this stuff over here too. All right. So we'll get that done, and we'll get that done, and we'll be good to go. Um, <laughs> I'm okay sucking out all of the water. I see that, you know, because of this, I will have to put another pump here maybe, but uh, we'll do that later. All right. Well, that's really good progress that we were able to do all of that um, and kind of just power through some items so that we can um, progress and get some things going, you know, for our colony. 
um, and improving things. Um, so we will continue to do so, obviously. We've got more stuff to build out and take care of. Um, so we'll, we'll do that. Ah, he's so happy. He's elderly, but he's happy. <laughs> Which means he'll lay an egg soon. So that's good. Um, so as we get the oxygen in, we need to start clearing out more stuff. Do I have something on the vent over here? Not really, but possibly. And I noticed that our lock over here is wrong. Or is gone. Let's let's fix this while we're here. Because our issue before was we were always accidentally spilling water inside. We can fix this now. So we'll do that. I'm going to put this back up on the normal speed. Normal for me in that it's always on the medium. Starvation. Does that mean someone's trapped? No, it just means that you're on the phone talking. I was going to say, we we have food. We have grub fruit and raw eggs. Is it because... Is that why you're starving? I mean, I don't necessarily want to allow you to eat the grub fruit nut, but if there's nothing to eat... I will do this really quick so that you can grab one and eat and not die. Still says we're starving. But we're cooking. I don't want to eat all the grub fruit. Okay, we're not starving anymore. Let's take it back off. I don't want I don't want him to use that. I want to turn it into grub fruit preserve. Bristleberry barbecue. Okay, so we're cooking up a storm. I, just, I don't know why for some reason it seemed like something was happening. Um, let's check our <clears throat> Do we got the what what's this one collecting? Maybe we haven't adjusted these. No, you're picking up grub fruit. Okay. You're picking up grub fruit. You're picking up grub fruit. Okay. And of course, we may have some stuff in between. But, um... We'll get that taken care of. All the shipping's going the right places, right? My goodness. <laughs> How can we tell? Um... <clears throat> to be honest, I'm not quite sure where this goes. I can't see the overlay because of the machines. I know that it's either going, well, it can't, oh, it's a bridge. Okay, so it's going this way, bridge, coming up, bridge, coming up, coming into here. Yeah, so this should be all set. We're going the right way. Okay, just, I figured, but sometimes you just, you, you know, you gotta check. <laughs> because you don't know. So, it, it's good to check. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> cool. Uh, we still have some... We've got gas in here that I want to get rid of. So... See, this is... Okay, so here's, here's what we're going to do. I want to get rid of this stuff. We Okay, we've got the pumps in place already so I'm gonna do this really quick I thought we had the pumps in place but let's hook these back up because they were all coming up here this way and into the filter yeah let, let, let's just do this for a little bit I might not even need this one but let's let's get that. I do see that we need to put that there. <clears throat> and then we probably need to move this out, but okay, that's another story. That that's things that we gotta do.
There we go. All right, cool. Do, does this come off two different grids? This one comes off here. And this one is coming off here. Okay, that's a bridge. They're not connected. Never mind. Okay. All right, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Don't panic. All right, and see, we're already pumping over water into here. And this system is going. Cool. We need to do that so we can reach those. All right, awesome. So that gets us going in several different areas from that perspective. We, you know, pushed through. We made some changes. Um, this is almost done pumping this out. Look, it's dropped this. Um, so we'll be able to... Not that we have to get all this out of here, but, you know, that is a good plus. <clears throat> this one's still pulling out stuff. What is it pulling out? It is pulling out mm, just a little bit. I'm going to go ahead and just de disable this one. Actually, actually, enable. It's so much quicker to do this. Boom. Okay, we're going to shut that one off for now. If anything, we could put one over here if we wanted to pull some of this out. But, I mean, we don't have to. That's just extra work. Not that we're power shortage. We're not. But it's just extra work that we don't have to do right this moment. Um... I am going to go ahead and get this set up because that is uh, something we were going to do previously. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Get those so that we're not confused. And an automation wire the rest of the way. Alright, so this is still going before this. So do I need to alternate them? This one needs to be this... Or is this... So we're going to do 30 and 6, 55. There we go. If we can get these running. Because don't these produce more water? Um, let me look. 750 gallons or grams per second. And this is only 60. Yeah, see? So it makes sense to power on these things. So how do we... If I turn this up all the way... No, that turns them on all the way. If I turn it down, it shuts them off permanent. For the most part. Kind of like what I've done here. That way, these are the ones that are going to run. There we go. Alright, cool. We're going to do that. That's going to produce a lot more water. Um, so that makes sense to do that. All right. <laughs> so I think our next step is to go take a look at Smironi um, and go from there. We've, we've accomplished taking care of our water issue. Um, I'm going to turn this one off. Actually, it can stay on. The difference is, is I'm going to disconnect the pipe again there we go because we're we're now bringing we're handling the water from here and from here <laughs> excellent which means i can probably go ahead and get in another one of these this is i know this is kind of a manual way of doing this but there we go we're gonna do it anyways we got the ice you know, let's 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 take advantage of it as a solution, um, and then you know <laughs> we have more ice. We can come up and we can hmm, we can start mining this out. You know, I mean, if if we to keep going, so so that we can collect more 
All right, we'll we'll tag it anyways, just so that it's done. All right. So the only thing we have to fix is our oxygen. Uh, we're gonna sweep up a couple more of these so that you guys will send them over to Smirani. All right. <clears throat> Everybody's happy, everybody's happy, everybody's happy. We got so many happies. That is good. Um, excellent. <clears throat> so that's three farms of spindly grub fruit to help push us. <coughs> we might eventually do another one, but for now, I think it'll slowly recover. The most important thing probably is these here. Um, this way we can have the stuffed berry as well. Um, because that's what we need for stuffed berry, right? Yeah, we need pitcher pep pepper nuts. I think the main issue over here was temperature or was it atmosphere? Temperature, we're at 41. We're fine. It was probably atmosphere. Yeah. <laughs> We need, preferably... No, it just needs air pressure, so the atmosphere doesn't matter. It, it just needs the water. Ah, yes. Okay. It needs the polluted water. And it needs the right atmosphere. That is right. And so right now, we're not getting as much of the polluted water as we need to keep that going. Okay, so that's something that we could look at a little bit later as well. Oh yeah, we got this set up. Yes, I know you're saving game. Good job. Let's get this back in place. There, we gotta get our lock back and re our lock ready. Otherwise, we're going to get more stuff in because I don't think more natural gas could come in the base. So we'll get that. How are we looking? Okay, good. We're pushing it down. It is stuck, though, because we don't have room for any of this. Okay, so we have to cook before we can get rid of more of the gas. Okay, well, we can do that. Uh, what do we got right here? This is brine. Brine. There we go. Sweep only. Uh, sweep. 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 Might have enough here to do this. Probably not, but you never know. Get them all cleaned up anyways. Sweet. <clears throat> okay, so that got rid of all that, Brian. Don't we have one sitting here? We have a salt water right here. Sweet. And put this one to salt. That'll take care of it. Excellent. <clears throat> well, it's not the best food, but congratulations. You got a little swamp shard hearts to munch on. All right, well, that completes this episode. In the next episode, we're going to move on and concentrate on some new things now that we've got some stuff happening. Look, these have melted already, so perfect. It's what we want to do. All right, thank you for joining, everybody. Take care.